Hello everyone, I'd like to introduce the brand new 2024 recently redesigned squash splitboard. Squash splitboard is probably one of the most famous splitboards on the market because basically it just introduced fun boarding to splitboarding. And now we've redesigned the entire shape of this to give it more float in the pow and make it more fun connecting turns with a new swallowtail shape and a different nose shape. The squash split has a directional swallowtail splitboard shape, which we just introduced this year. And what that means is the nose is nice and long, providing a lot of float in the powder. And where the swallowtail tail here, it's a little lifted. So what that means is you can still uh, navigate and go switch in those sketchy situations. Has true camber, standard camber underfoot from contact point to contact point, giving you that stability you need for riding down, but most importantly, also giving you that kick you want for the skin walk up. Has a mid-wide width, which means the board is wider than a standard board. It's gonna provide you more surface area when you are floating down the powder, but also when you're going up, it's gonna give you more edge hold on the skin track up. Has an all-terrain flex and a progressive side cut. Progressive side cuts are sick because in the nose, it's a mellow side cut through the binding inserts right here, making it nice and easy when initiated turns. But when you get back into the tail of the board here, it's gonna get more aggressive and you're gonna get a tighter radius, making it so you have more power. You can really generate power out of your back leg. It has our power light core, which is our lightest core made out of an ultra lightweight poplar wood material. It's gonna keep the board lightweight, but snappy and also very durable. Has our split board core profile, which means it's a little beefed up in the middle here, providing more support when you're in skin mode walking up, making it more efficient and giving you more power on the walk up. Has our bi-light laminates for more stability throughout the entire board, and has nitros, sintered, speed formula HD base. Sinter bases are the best because they go fast and they hold wax like nothing else. Nitro Squash Splitboard has a uh, Nitro's tip and tail lock, nice and beefy, so it's easy to lock them up, get them on and off, even with gloves at the summit when it's super cold. They are interchangeable, so you can change it, put something else on if you want to. And on the squash, it is only on the nose as you see here. So that actually helps reduce the overall weight of the board as well. What holds the board together is Nitro's Forge T7075 aluminum hooks, which are these low profile hooks right here, which are raised so there are no marks on the bottom. So you get a clean base, but you get a super solid connection point here in the nose and in the tail. And you can adjust them if you want to, to pull the boards closer together. It does come pre-mounted, so it should be ready to go, ready to rip right out of the bag. It uses Nitro's and Koala skin attachment system, which are these holes here on the nose and on the tail. That fits with the Nitro Koala skins and every board length has a pre-cut Nitro Koala skin available. And the squash uses the higher, lighter, grippier mohair skin. I would recommend the Nitro Squash Splitboard. Looking for that snowboard that has a hyper focus on the fun run down. It's gonna get you to the top, just like all the other splitboards, but you're gonna be having way more fun on the ride down than everyone else. So if that's what you're looking for, look no further than the brand new 2024 Nitro Squash Split. Thanks for watching, I'll see you later. Hopefully on the split trail. If you see me, just pass me, I'm, I'm super slow.